Hi, welcome back to Brain Flow TV slash Hot Topics TV. If you've never been here before, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and let's get right into the topic. ASAP Rocky, which is Rihanna's baby daddy, husband. No, they're not married on paper, but they're married as in married as in presents themselves as a couple, been together for a while shacked up, living together, making babies together. In the Caribbean and other places, we call it common law husband, right? And he is the father of her children. We're talking about Riri. Come, Mr. DJ, come on the replay. Yeah, Rihanna. Ella, Ella, under my umbrella. Rihanna, no introduction needed. ASAP Rocky is headed to trial for an alleged shooting. Everything we know about it is right here. I'm about to give it to you. But check this out. This is some this is a serious charge, right? And ASAP could be facing some time in prison, which means Rihanna is gonna be sitting alone with those babies until daddy comes home doing a bid in the penitentiary. Will ASAP Rocky go to prison? I'll put it to you like this. I have never seen a black man use a gun. Shoot it, pow, after somebody, and ends up walking away on probation or going free. Tory Lanes, I'm just saying. So, rapper ASAP Rocky is headed to trial in October for allegedly shooting his childhood friend on the corner of a Los Angeles street over two years ago. The father of Rihanna's two children, whose real name is Rakim Mayers, has pleaded not guilty to two counts of assault with a semi-automatic firearm after allegedly firing shots at rapper ASAP Relly. Yeah, ASAP Rocky, ASAP Relly. It's not hard to tell. It's kind of like YNW Melly, YNW Juvie, YNW Sack Chaser. Y'all saw what happened over there. Same thing over here, okay? They're a part of the same group, and they had a falling out. ASAP Rocky had a falling out with the homie ASAP Relly, and it ended up being something bad happening in the end. ASAP Rocky, 35 years old now, has a trial date that is set for October 21st of 2024. If the rapper plans to file a motion to dismiss the case, it must be done by July 19th, according to the judge. Well, this is a criminal case that involves a shooting. If he plans to file a motion to dismiss the case, I'm sure his attorney is going to move for that. But if the person, ASAP Relly, decides, I want to press charges and I want to take this to court, it's going to trial. Unless they could pay ASAP Relly off a nice amount of money behind the scenes, and quiet this whole thing down and then make it go away. Which probably could be done. Long money talks silently. Get that? Okay, Rihanna is a billionaire. ASAP is a millionaire. Relly, Relly is kind of salty about the relationship with ASAP Rocky and how things went. They was in a group. It was said that whoever blows up first on a solo tip was supposed to come back and take care of the rest of the brothers of the group. And they said that ASAP Rocky blew up and he didn't look back. He didn't reach back. He didn't take care of his brothers. So he started making fun of ASAP Relly. Yo, you in that dirty ass hotel, you bum boy. I'm supposed to take care of you your whole life. You broke ninja. This, that, and the other, right? While he was living in the lap of luxury. So ASAP Relly is saying... Well, for all that, and for your failed promise, as a part of a group, I'm going to make you pay. Guess what? It was reported that they have video footage of the incident when it went down. But we'll get more into that in a minute. ASAP's lawyer, Sarah Kaplan, said that she is still waiting for the medical records that are related to Relly's alleged hospital visit as it was reported by Rolling Stone. The alleged shooting. So in a preliminary hearing last November, 2023 November, prosecutors showed a video of the alleged gun assault from November 6th of 2021 
on the corner of Selma and Vista Del Mar Avenues in Hollywood. Y'all heard that? The prosecutor showed a video in court of the alleged gun assault. I told y'all, they said the street cameras were out. Uh, a camera that nobody could see. You're being monitored. And the incident took place under that camera. The video shows a man whose face is not seen walking down the sidewalk near a parking garage. He turns and he starts firing shots at another person. The two back out of the camera's view with their hands still around each other's neck. A third person try to break up the two of them. It's kind of like your homie throw his hand around your neck and then pull his firearm out like on some movie stuff. Like the movie Juice with Tupac in it. Put his arm around his neck, pull the hammer out and hit him bang bang with it. Right? Riley says he spun away from him and he started running. And while he was running, he couldn't believe. He was like, yo, he about to kill me out here in the streets. And he got grazed. Relly, ASAP Relly, actually sat down and gave a deposition or told his side of what happened to the laws. So this ain't one of them cases where it's like he's not talking. He was talking. Whether he talks at trial will be a whole nother situation. So the video shows again a man whose face is not seen walking down the sidewalk near a parking garage. He turns and he starts firing at another person. And the two of them back out of the camera view with their hands still around each other's necks. A third person tries to break it up. Prosecutors said that the video captured the start of the altercation between ASAP Rocky and ASAP Relly, whose real name is Terrell Efron, a Los Angeles Police Department detective testified in November that the video from the parking garage shows ASAP Rocky with the gun in his hand. Oh my God. A Los Angeles Police Department detective testified that the footage shows ASAP Rocky with a gun in his hands. He later conceded there was no weapon recovered in the case and said that the video was inconclusive. <laughs> you see, you see what I'm saying? He later conceded, took back his talk and said that there was no weapons recovered in the case and that the video was inconclusive. Inconclusive meaning I can't really make out if that's really him or not. Um, I don't really know if that's a gun or not. It looks like there's something in his hand that could be a gun, but we're not too sure kind of thing. Now, while the video shown had no audio on it, other surveillance clips from separate buildings nearby captured the sounds of the gun going off. Hmm. Superior Court Judge M.L. Villar said that she was taking into account that Relly said that he was allegedly shot. Well, in Relly's statement, Relly said he got grazed by a gunshot. He could have been shot. She said that she only needed a scintilla of evidence, a, a little sliver of evidence from prosecutors to find probable cause. That's like an eyelash worth of evidence to find probable cause. In his testimony, Relly said, that he was a victim of an ambush, armed ambush. Relly had sent ASAP Rocky a text message about how the rapper is big headed and did not pay for the funeral expenses for a friend of theirs who passed away. The text from October 28th said, you so fucking fake, it's sad. And that text was actually shown in court. ASAP Rocky never responded to the text. Now, I believe it was ASAP Yams that passed away from a drug overdose. And they went uh, and found out later on that ASAP Rocky actually did pay for the uh, entire funeral and all that. Right? Now, after the exchange, Relly said that he was in a car with ASAP Rocky, with ASAP Bari, 
whose real name is Jabari Shelton. Jabari Shelton was the first one who put it out on media that ASAP Rocky shot at ASAP Relly and could have killed him. Bari was allegedly on the phone, and Relly heard ASAP Rocky say on the car phone that he had beat me up, that I'm emotional. Relly then claims that ASAP Rocky reached out over a week later on November 6th, 2021, and the two agreed to talk face to face, which Relly testified was a setup for the alleged shooting. So they riding in the car, he hears them talking back and forth, and he's like, yo, you know what? Let's just meet up and settle this, right? Relly says, I'm thinking we are gonna meet up and settle this like brothers, cause that's how we used to move like brothers. That's why we have ASAP at the beginning of all our names, right? But it was a setup. He didn't want to talk nothing out with me. ASAP Rock, you wanted to shoot me. So he said, I was talking a bunch of shit. That's what Efron said in the testimony. I wasn't doing anything physically. I was just so mad. It didn't sit well with me. And I wanted him to hear my side. I knew I was never going to see this man again. He said ASAP Rocky fired a few times out of the gun before running away and that the initial gunshot grazed his left hand. Villar ruled in the preliminary, that's the judge, ruled in the preliminary hearing that there is sufficient evidence to find and charge someone for these crimes that were committed and more than sufficient cause to believe that Mayers or ASAP Rocky is guilty of having committed these things that he is charged for based on the video and Relly's statement or testimony combined. This is, an, this is a judge that's telling us already that there is probable cause and there is more than enough to find him guilty. ASAP Rocky's defense lawyer, Joe Takapina, had previously called the allegations a false scenario. Takapina also said that ASAP Relly, he was just trying to shake ASAP Rocky down for some of that money that him and Rihanna got over there. Now, if you want to know who ASAP Rocky is, ASAP Rocky started his music career as a member of a group. The name of the group was the ASAP Mob. In August of 2011, his, he had a single out that was called Peso. Peso was leaked online. And within weeks, it was playing on the radio because it blew up and got so hot. ASAP Rocky then signed with Polo Grounds Music and he released his first mixtape later on that year. ASAP Rocky's debut album, Long Live ASAP, became a double platinum after its 2013 release. The kid just blew up. The rapper has won a BET award, two BET Hip Hop Awards, an MTV Music Award in Japan, and an MTV U Woody Awards. ASAP Rocky has been nominated for two Grammy Awards and six World Music Awards, and ASAP Rocky has been connected to Rihanna since 2013, and the couple currently have two children together at the moment. Now, Rocky was first arrested for the November 2021 shooting back in 2023, April, and then he was released from custody on a $550,000 bond. I don't know if y'all remember when him and Riri took a little trip to uh, the island that she is from, Barbados, and on their way back from Barbados, the police just ran down on them and arrested ASAP. Rocky. That's the same case situation that's been going on ever since. The rapper was previously arrested in 2019 in Sweden for simple assault. Videos uploaded to the Instagram that he owns shows that he and his entourage repeatedly asked a man, asked two young men to stop following us. Please stop following us, man. The second video clip shows that the man who accused ASAP of the assault or the altercation was hitting the rapper's bodyguard with his headphones. 
ASAP Rocky served over a month in jail. And Donald Trump was over there saying, free ASAP Rocky. Anyhow, that's the end of that. My question is, do you think that ASAP Rocky is going to prison to do jail time like Tory Lanez? Or do you think Rihanna's money and his money is going to speak loudly, I mean quietly, even though it's loud money, and he will be able to beat this case? Do you also think that ASAP Rally might be jealous, a bit jealous of ASAP Rocky's rise to fame and his stardom as well as his money? Because wifey got a whole lot. She's a billionaire. And he might be looking for a hefty payday so he himself can call it a day. Leave your comments in the comment section below. And I'll catch you on the next video. This is Hot Topics TV slash Brain Flow TV. And you already know, if the topic is hot, we're on it. I'm out. Hit that subscribe button. Peace.